Welcome back. Now, if you're looking to fill your house with love and affection this holiday season, the Jacksonville Humane Society has the perfect opportunity. Joining us to discuss the Silent Night Foster <laughs> Program for animals during the holidays is Lindsay Leyendecker from Jacksonville Humane Society. Good to see you. Good to see you guys. Who'd you bring with you? This is Bree. Brie like the cheese. Nice. Um, and she's a very sweet little girl. She's ready in her Christmas jammies to go home for Silent Night. I love I it. Love so Silent it. Night program, this started around 2012. How does the program yeah. work? Um, it's basically, it's a foster program where you temporarily take a pet home over the holidays. It starts today. And you take them home, you get to spoil them, give them lots of presents, get to know them. If you want to adopt them, great. If not, that's fine too. Um, they can come back to JHS or maybe you could keep them and find them a new family yourself. Oh, that's great. All right, so you guys have been doing this for a little while now. Mm -hmm. All right. Yes, what has the results been like? Years. We have about a 30% adoption rate. So about a 30% of the pets that go out um, are kept by the families that foster them. And even if they're not kept, it's really okay because they come back and they tell us all kinds of wonderful details like they got along with children or, you know, they loved going to the beach and that helps us find them a new home even faster than before. All right. So people out there, you can, and it's cats too, cats or cats, dogs. Absolutely. Yep. Any animal in our shelter can go out. Um, and so what do people have to do to take part in this? I love that one, just chilling on the couch. He's like, yeah, <laughs> look at me. I live here now. Um, <laughs> what do people have to do? Just come by. Um, there's both shelters in Jacksonville are participating this year, so you can stop by JHS on Beach Boulevard or ACPS um, over in Riverside and pick out a pet that you think you want to take home, talk to the staff, and they can go home the same day. Um, it'll speed up the process if you're able to bring a leash or a cat carrier with you. Um, that way we can send you home a little bit faster. But there's no cost associated, so just stop by the shelters. I love that. Okay, so now that's the foster program for the holidays. How does the foster mm -hmm. program work maybe throughout the whole year? Um, at JHS, we've got lots of different foster options. We always need fosters for baby kittens. Um, and then for some of our adult pets that have been with us for a while, you could take them home and foster them as well, learn about them, and then help find them a family. All right, so uh, for Silent Night, though, uh, when it, when does it go up until, like, starting now? Obviously, you're, you're taking... Now, yep, starts today um, all the way through Christmas Eve. Shelters are open until 2 p.m. on Christmas Eve, so there's lots of time. And then um, they can come back the day after Christmas, starting then. And one of the things you mentioned was, look, even if you're out there, if you're going to take the dog home and you know you don't want to take, you don't want to keep this dog. Mm hmm the posts of you with an animal at your house on your social media... Yes. A lot of times you said other people then end up... Absolutely. Yeah, it worked on me. Someone posted <laughs> a picture and um, last and I was in St. Louis um, for the holidays and I said, that dog's in Jacksonville. And I said, that dog's from our shelter. And so I adopted my dog that way. So you can find a home um, for a pet. You never know who's creeping on your social media, yeah. right? you know, looking for a dog or cat. And it's a great way to help an animal. Okay, so for someone that's never owned a pet before, if they wanted to partake in, in this program, what kind of advice would you have for them? Um, definitely just take your time and talk to our staff. Um, our staff is there to answer any question that you might have. There's a ton of information on our website, so don't feel overwhelmed and don't feel like anyone's going to judge you because you don't know what you're doing. You know, we're here to help, so let us help you. And if you're looking for last minute gift ideas to give away and you want to help somebody out, JHS, JacksHumane.org, you guys always have a, uh, like a wish list on there? We do, yep. JacksHumane.org slash wish list. Um, you can send an item from our Amazon wish list. It'll ship right to our front door. Um, you can drop off donations seven days a week with us. Um, and we have a really cute boutique now. So if you're looking for something special for a dog or cat lover, um, stop by your Beach Boulevard location and check out our shop. Nice. Cool. I love it. So this could actually serve as a gift. You just, like, if you want to get someone yeah. a puppy, but it's only for a limited time. Mm -hmm. You can see how well they there you go. test it out with the children. I love Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Thanks right. so much for being here, Bree. Thank you for having us. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Head to jackhumane.org to get information about the foster program and to our website to see this segment again.